Hey guys, what's up? Grant here. Um, I know it's been a long time. It's been quite a few months since I've gotten back on here. Um, I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update about everything. You've probably seen all the pictures and stuff I've been posting, but um, you guys, a lot of you don't know a lot of what's been going on um, as far as my health is concerned. So I just wanted to do a little chit chat with you guys today, just catch up. Um, I want to say first and foremost, thank you for all my loyal subscribers as always. I know a lot of you have subscribed from my reaction videos. I haven't really been uh, doing them the past few months. There's just been a lot going on. Um, first and foremost, you guys know I'm very busy with my band. Um, I, For those of you who don't know, I'm the lead singer of a wedding band in Naples. We do weddings, events, corporate events, country clubs, all that good jazz. So I've been on the road doing a ton of shows with them. I've been uh, just, you know, working, working, working. Um, I have a day job here in Miami, um, but also um, I have had a lot of problems. I've been dealing with a very severe foot uh, issue, um, which I wanted to talk with you guys about. And I'm actually, um, big uh, reveal, I, didn't, I don't like to talk too much about what's, you know, things that I'm doing until they're actually done, but I'm actually moving in a couple weeks to Naples. Um, finally, um, it's been a year in the making. I've been, you know, working hard to make it happen. And I'm, you know, I got a beautiful place in Naples. I'm moving um, actually the beginning of April in a couple weeks. So I'm getting ready for that exciting. But my foot problem has been a chronic issue that I'm actually, uh, uh, getting surgery for um we are arranging surgery my podiatrist and i in the next couple weeks so i'm very very uh, nervous about that but it has to be done um for those of you who are don't know i have uh, two conditions um i actually have morton's neuroma i don't know if you've heard of it i'll explain it in a minute if you haven't i have morton's neuroma and i have bursitis in both of my feet um, and a little bit about what those conditions entail. Morton's neuroma basically is a severe thickening of a nerve in your in in between your um, your tendons in the forefoot in your forefoot basically um, that causes all sorts of pain, inflammation, etc. And I don't have just one; I have three of them in each foot, um, and it's from basically. If you guys have seen my pictures on, you know, the past couple, couple years, the shoes I was wearing um, at the, last year basically ruined my feet. And it was my fault. They were very, very narrow. They were way too tight. They didn't fit, but I kept wearing them. Um, you know, I'm a fashion person, you guys know, and I, you know, it's my fault what happened. But, you know, they basically, they squeezed and compressed my feet until those ner those neuromas formed and that this you know basically it's like a nerve tumor but it's not cancerous but there's no going back once the nerves are um you know they get bigger and they're inflamed that's permanent um and they have di there's different treatments there's a ton of different treatments but um i've tried basically everything and my podiatrist we've worked together but it's at the sort of point of no return um so we're arranging to have them removed um, and I'm very nervous about that because I'm going to be off my feet for a few weeks. And um, I had actually surgery on my right foot five years ago. I had MRSA in my right foot that almost took my leg. So this is like, you know, part two of that, I guess. But it's, you know, completely different problem. Just as bad, if not worse, though. So especially the past week, um, I have actually been bedridden. I haven't been able to work or do anything because I've been the inflammation, the pain got so bad at my last show in Naples last week. Um, I've been on a whole bunch of medic. I'm like right now I'm a little loopy because I'm like on a ton of medication. Um, but I've been on um, actually steroids. Uh, the past week to try to get the inflammation down and I've been in bed. I've just been feeling really, really bad and I'm feeling a little bit, you know, the pain is tolerable under control because I'm on, you know, opioids right now um, and a bunch of other stuff. But that is what's been going on. If you guys have been wondering, I have just been sort of um, off my feet, um, not doing the best, but we're getting the situation handled. It's just going to be, I'm, um, you know, not going to be 100% for a while. Um, but I'm, I'm just, uh, you know, looking forward to getting this, you know, problem that's been, you know, 
going on for the past year handled. Um, and I'm just, you know, grateful to, you know, still be able to, you know, do some of the things I need to do. I'm not completely dead, but it's what's been going on. Um, but like I said, I want to, uh, you know, I just wanted to catch you guys up to, you know, everything that's been going on because I feel bad. I haven't been really talking to you guys a lot. Um, it's just been really hard to handle. I've been at my every every time I perform, I've been in I've been in pain and I've been sort of, you know, pushing through the pain, pushing through the pain, the discomfort. And um, if you guys, like I said, if you don't know what it feels like, some of you might have had the same condition, some might not. But basically, my feet, my foot, I have, like I said, the problem in both feet, but the, the right foot's not, you know, too much of a problem. The left foot is chronic, which is why I'm having the surgery done. But it's basically, it feels like you have a rock in the sole of your foot and the pain is stinging, it's burning, it's throbbing, it's every kind of pain you can imagine is radiating from the middle of your foot into your toes. And it was, it used to be, you know, once in a blue moon, um, the pain originally at the beginning of the year, when I started with my band, it started really bad and the inflammation was bad. It went away as I, you know, I took time off the gym and everything. The pain went away and it was barely noticeable. I went, started going heavy the past few months back in the gym and everything to get ready for summer and the pain ramped up the inflammation and it got worse than ever the past two weeks. Um, and now, like I said, the, the pain and the burning and everything is constant. That's why I'm having to, I'm, I'm on, you know, opioid painkillers and I'm on, you know, test, I'm on steroids to keep it at bay so I can function. But it's like, it's a horrible, horrible thing to go through. Absolutely terrible. It's some of the worst pain I've ever had in my life. Um, but it's managed. And like I said, I just wanted to tell you guys all about it. Um, beside that, um, the reaction videos. I said this before when I, you know, took a, a break. I took another break from doing them earlier last year. I have explained this uh, to you guys several times, but um, these reaction videos are, I, I know you guys love them and I absolutely love, you know, talking to you guys about some of your favorite artists you've seen on my channel, but um, the, the, it's just, it's an ongoing problem with these reaction videos. First and foremost, um, my channel, you know, I do make a little bit of money from my channel. It is monetized, but I only make a quarter of the money that my channel generates because the rest of that money goes to these record labels, uh, because of copyright, you know, laws with these songs that I'm reacting to. So I don't see barely any of the money that I actually earn from this channel. And it, you know... It is an it it is an issue because at the while I do love doing all this stuff, I you know rely on you know all of these things that I do my music my you know my work with my band everything it's my job this is all my income this is how I make my living this is how I support myself you know what I mean so um, while I do love our get-togethers you know with these reaction videos it, it's a, and it's become an issue because I'm not seeing the money that I'm earning putting all this effort into shooting these videos, editing, etc. And it's very time consuming. It takes me hours to do one video, you know what I mean? And for me to only make, you know, a couple dollars on each video after all the work I put in, it's not, it's, you know, it's not okay. So I, as I, I, I told you guys earlier in the year, I wanted to sort of branch out from reaction videos and do other things that would, you know, bring more of an income to my channel, you know, and I do still want to, you know, occasionally do reaction videos, but there has to be more on this channel for it to be profitable, um, if that makes sense to you guys. So let me guys, let me know. Um, I would like to do, you know, other things, maybe like story times, maybe, you know, uh, how to videos, you know, talk to you guys about my work with the band, talk to you guys about my experience as a music business, all kind of stuff. There's a bunch of different options and I would love to branch out on this channel in the near future. You know, I'm not saying anytime soon because I'm still in the midst of my foot problem, but once everything, you know, once I'm recovering and everything, I would like to get back to the channel and start to do other things, branch out. So let me guys know your ideas. If you'd like me to do any of that, I'm always open to, you know, new avenues and new, you know, paths. So I'm, like I said, I'm an open uh, book. You can talk to me about that. Um, and I look forward to um, showing you guys more of, you know, my stuff with my band. We're actually 
gonna be doing our promo video that's been in the works for this entire year, the next couple weeks. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm excited about that, despite having this chronic foot p problem. Um, and we are actually going to be tapering down on the next <coughs> few months. It's sort of the end of the season. Uh, so we're going to be uh, sort of on a little bit of a break. So I'm going to be, like I said, in recovery from my foot operation during that time. But let me know if you guys would like to see different things on this channel. And like I said, I'd be happy to bring it, uh, you know, in the near future, whenever everything is settled, all the dust is settled. Um, and I'm going to let you guys go. I just, uh, I'm, I wanted to, you know, like I said, I want to talk to you guys about what's been going on, catch up to speed and sort of, you know, do a little get together today. But once again, I'm so grateful that all of you are, you know, still on this channel, despite me not being present for a few months. Um, and I hope you guys stick with me and see everything that's, you know, hopefully to come forth uh, moving forward. Um, I do have a lot of plans for the, you know, the next year. <clears throat> I'm going to be, you know, a new Naples resident. I'm super, super excited about that. I, you know, I feel like I did what I had to do on the... East Coast of, uh, you know, Florida, and now I'm moving to the West Coast, and I'm excited about the new, you know, beginning, my new beginning there. And like I said, hopefully there's much more to come. Um, I want to wish you guys a wonderful day, a wonderful new week. Um, I hope everything, you know, you everybody gets off to a good start, and I look forward to seeing you in the near future. Take care. Peace.